Alrighty, guys, we're here rocking the 12W16A snapshot. This is a first pre release of 1.6, and I decided I'd do a video on it. So, we're just gonna go up in the world that I've already created and to showcase all of the new world, most of the new features. Alrighty. Um, first up, we've got carpets. This is something that's probably been t anticipated by a whole lot of people. I'm just going to grab all of these. As you can see, this is how it's crafted. You can use any color wool. And this is how it looks. I'm just going to plop down all the different colors. You'll have to give me a sec, because I what, didn't exactly plan out any commentary for this. I think so far, as far as Minecraft history is concerned, this is one of my favorite updates that is not yet updated. I don't know why I had 64 of each of them since I was going to be doing this in creative. But yeah, these are all the different color types. I may or may not have missed one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Wait, wait, 14, 15, 16, 17, oh, excuse me, I'm bad at math. I think that's all of them? Not sure, though. Anyway, and as far as the grass, the shovel, and the enchanting vial, you can see why those are in there later, and the diamond helmet. So, we've got horse armor. Now, this can be made with any color wool. It can be made with iron, gold, or diamonds. And these are the outcome, and I will be showing you those in a bit. This is how you craft the new saddles. It's This is basically derived from Mo Creatures. Also, this is how you will be able to craft the hay bales in the future, as far as I'm led to believe by many sources. Um, it does not currently have a crafting recipe, and this works a lot like wood in the way that it's placed. You place it against a vertical surface, and it will be planted vertical, do it horizontally, it'll be done horizontally. Just like that. So now, let's get into the actual horses. Now, now this is something I've been really waiting for and been really excited for. Okay, that's a donkey or a mule. I That's the first time I've gotten one of those, but uh, let's get a cooler looking horse. That's Um. <laughs> oh, there's a black one that I wanted to showcase with. Oh, whatever. Let's just go with. Let's go with you. Now you have to feed them a lot of weed, if I'm not mistaken. Then you get on their back, and they, if you manage to tame them, they'll be all heartsy. But you can't really control them left shift to dismount. You can't really control them until you plop a saddle on them. Once you've plopped a saddle on them, you can ride them and they're uber fast. Now you can get off and you can put armor on it. And this is what all the different armor colors look like. Going through them again, this is diamond, that's iron, and that's gold. Now, and this is another feature I read about, I'm not sure if it's implemented yet, but, um, get off. Can I not do that yet? Is that a crafting recipe then? Um, I read that you can, oh, I don't have a workbench. Well, damn it. Um, I read that you can put a chest on a horse's saddle. Let's try switching game modes for that, though. Maybe not. Hmm. One sec, guys. I'll be right back. Alright, guys. I'm back, and I found the problem. It's because horses can't do what I was talking about earlier. 
So we're going to have to feed this guy, just feed him a bunch of wheat. Get on top of him till he loves us. A. There you go. Get off of him. Put a saddle on him. And. Voila! Looks kind of derpy. Um. Can I not access the chest? <laughs> oh, man. Is there something in controls about that? Controls. Maybe if you get your inventory while on the horse. Or you... Hmm. Be right back. Alright guys, so I've looked around a little bit, and I don't think that feature is added yet, although I'm assuming that at some point you will be able to use these as such, as a portable chest, considering that you can put a chest on them. Um, now one thing, now let's just, no, that's right, wrong game mode. I was confused for a second there. Um, maybe it's possible that right clicking with certain items will give you it. Um, just gonna try a couple here that might work. I'm not sure. Don't call me an idiot, please. <laughs> um, also, this is another item. The leash, as I believe it is called. Mm, yeah, that doesn't work. Go away. So, I'm going to... That's not what I wanted to happen. So maybe if we hmm, shift right click maybe? No. Um, but there is something I wanted to show with these while I'm here. And I should have had this already ready. I apologize for not. But if we just, just follow me over here, guy. Just put up a little fence post. Maybe, maybe not. And there we go. So now he shouldn't go anywhere. I don't think. And. Basically, you can just have them stuck to a fence post now, which is very handy, I think. And I think you can do this with all mobs. Let's just try a random mm. mob. Mm. Hell yeah! Look at that. Can you just do it with an untamed mob? You cannot. Mm. So this is actually the first tameable mob in Minecraft. So, I think that's all the features I have. Wait, let's just a second. Let's see if you can do this. I don't think you can. Alrighty then. Wait, I'm, I'm trying to see if hitting them possibly takes the chest off. Uh, come on, stop, 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 stop. No, it just hits him in the ass. Alright, so, now this is the next thing I wanted to show you. As you can see, there's currently a bug with the... That's the only reason the uh, chanting thing was there. <laughs> to show the bug. Um, but this is something. Respiration has been improved. Now if we go... Fucking squid. Now as you can see, tools no longer... <laughs> Tools <laughs> no longer have um, slow time underwater when you have a full respiration in chain. Now this is very cool, and it also lasts longer than it previously did. As you can see, the bubbles going down very slowly. This is very handy, I think. So I think that's all I wanted to show you guys for now. There's... can't really think of any... I'm trying to think. I can't really think of anything else. Um, oh yeah, I can think of something now. So if we get on our horse here... Maybe it doesn't work.
There's supposed to be some kind of jump bar. Hmm. Odd. No, get back on him. Mm hmm, so it breaks. That's cool. Um, and I'm pretty sure you can just... Um, that's kind of annoying that the head follows you. Um, I hope they change that so that I can look off to the side a little bit. Because it'd be nice to be able to, like, break blocks while I'm on a horse, so I can just be riding a horse all the time. Now, let's see how these guys react to water. Not very well. Where's the golden armor horse? There he is. Let's see how he reacts to water, because I'm pretty sure they can, like, swim through water. Or not. I guess not. That kind of stinks. Oh, well. So, anyway, um, Mojang is calling this the mob update, so I assume there's going to be more mobs added at a later date. Um, Dr. Zark is also to be credited for the help and the modeling of the horses. That much I know for sure, because this model is pretty much directly derived from Mo Creatures. Um, I think there's some slight differences. I can tell the textures are different. I have used Mo Creatures myself before, but as you can see, these mobs actually have joints. I'm not sure if that'll be added later to other mobs, but like all they have is like straight legs. Punch him and he runs around and see his legs are completely straight. Stiff boned, stiff boned. Anyway, also there's a glitch there where if the horse is ridden away from the post, then the animation or the texture stays there, but the rope actually comes off. Alright, so that's pretty much all I wanted to show you guys. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you later. Subscribe!